For a child, living in the absence of a parent may change how they cope with certain events or predicaments. In other ways, it might not affect them at all. In previous decades, single-parent households have become more common than they ever have been. Today, about a third of American children live without a father, and about a ninth without a mother. Yeah, I, uh, I have to depend more on one parent, and it's really cool. My uh, uncle and my grandpa, they both have stepped in as that, in that role and have helped me grow up to learn what I need to learn before I go off to college and that has changed me because I have a closer relationship with them and I've just been able to hang out with them and they live around here so I get to see them pretty often. Uh, it bothered me for a little bit whenever I was younger but after that I just got used to it. I got used to have, being able to rely on my uncle and my grandpa as the father figure in my life and just that helped me get over it. As it becomes a more prevalent part of so many lives, it begins to take a back seat in social development. Children are no longer affected as much as they have been in previous decades. Being with like just me and my mom and all my brothers, it's, uh, it's taught me to fend more for myself because um, like struggles in the family, like it's not really something that's affected me as much. Like after everything got done and over with and it was just my mom and me and all my brothers, uh, my mom had to like step up and like take care of five kids all by herself. And it's like, it's taught me to be more ready for situations where I might be on my own and not have anybody like helping me or anything. And it's gotten me used to like being more responsible and like taking action for my own problems and not waiting for somebody else to like step in and fix it for me. So I guess it's just made me a more responsible person and like ready to deal with something if it comes up. It doesn't really bother me now. Um, whenever I was young and it happened the first time it did a little bit like because I was still really young I didn't really get what was happening but when it happened again, I was about 12, and it really bothered me then because it's a really impressionable age for a child to, like, lose a parent. But now, like, I, I see my dad, like, once or twice a year, and it's just a normal thing, and I don't really think about it now. It's, like, it's a completely normal situation. It's, it's almost weird for me to talk to other people who have, like, two parents in the same household. I know more people with only one than actually have both their parents living with them, so... It's just weird because most people, it doesn't even seem to bother them. It's like a normal part of life now. Single parent families have become the norm, and as a result, children and young adults have learned to go on with life as if nothing is wrong. They live and laugh and love all the same. This chain of social evolution might not stop anytime soon, but in light of its effects, we can hope for a more faithful future. <laughs>